All right, this is episode 123. <laughs> One, two, three. And we're going to talk about diplomacy. Yeah. We're gonna and talk what about that, like, what the fuck is that? Because I, ahead, when you hear it, I'm like, diplomacy. I'm thinking it, diplomatic community. Go ahead, Chris. Getting a diploma from high school. No, Chris. Diplomacy. You know, what? Chris what is, to the people, Chris. Dipset, you know. But dipset. what it really what is. is dipset. <laughs> the the diplomats. Yeah, 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 yeah. Joel Santana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Dipset. Oh. Uh, J.R. Ryder. Jim Jones. All right. All right. But really, See, what it is. What it's it close, is. I'm too loud. Uh, is how you conduct yourself with other people. I forgot. I, I read the definition of it. How about we say it has to do with also the reputation you build. Uh, you know, like, right. Like the yeah, the reputation you build. It's kind of like you see yourself as a as a country, yes. and you have to have a good reputation so that so that Pe- people want to like take your side or, or help right. you out when you're in trouble right. or you know or have your back when someone talks shit about you. Right. Yeah, or, yeah, yeah. Or like they, they'll be it's. I'm it's, gonna be loud too. I'm gonna okay, camping too, fam. Yeah, like. Would you consider diplomacy equal to loyalty? Or there be just something that comes with being diplomatic. Nah, see, sometimes diplomacy means you have to like very nicely stab someone in the back. You think so? Sometimes yeah. you have to lie to people to be diplomatic. You know what I'm saying? Right. To to for everything to be kosher. Exactly. For everything to be exactly. cool. Like we talked about earlier. We talked about earlier. I couldn't sit there and tell you that you're wasting your life watching all those shows or you know watching porn or not right. doing anything. That would, that's not diplomatic. That would just right. be just being an asshole. Just judging you, fam. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> it'd be it'd be crass. Diplomatic would be like if you if I were to tell you how I discovered that I it wasn't a good idea for me. You know what I'm saying? And why I don't how you benefited from it. Yes, 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 how I It was the diplomatic yes. way because you sowed the seed. Yes. And and it's grown to harvest. Exactly. We're reaping what that's you what sowed. That's what it's about, bro. See? And that's diplomacy too. Right. Diplomacy is being able to say plant seeds without I pushing it in somebody's face. I don't need to be told I'm right because my I'm just trying to plant a seed, trying to plant a thought. And if you plant it the right way, it will sprout. You know what I'm saying? Now it was also watered by you, Romo, and Ed. You know what I mean? Because he y'all were all like inspirations because of the fact that you have energy to be boxing and shit. Like I would never have energy like skiing every day and shit. Yeah, energy to box. Oh, yeah, right. what do you do? You fight, <laughs> rumble, rep, roll. Run. Yeah, I can do all of it. Fight these people. You're a ninja, right? You're you're our security for sure. Um. So yeah, diplomacy. You gotta have diplomacy with. It it it, be, it befits you like it, it, it's like not burning bridges. Yes. Like you gotta be diplomatic yes. even if somebody yes. wrongs you. Like for example, best, best one of the best examples in a movie, Carlito's way. Okay, mm-hmm. had Carlito. Mm-hmm. Have, you see that? Had yes, he saw that. I showed yeah. him that shit. Sure. Had had Carlito oh. been more diplomatic when Benny Benny Blanco from the Bronx yeah. to roast him, yeah. bro? What would have happened? Benny Blanco from the Bronx wouldn't have fucking killed him in the end. Yeah. But would have if Benny would have had yes, paradise. Yes, he would have went to paradise. Even though, even though, even though Carlito knew that when he met Benny, he was a fucking zero and a fucking momo. You know what I'm saying? Like. He could have, you know what, just shook in his hand, you know, showed him, you know, showed him a little bit of love. He's got to remember yeah. these young cats. Some of them, they're gonna come up, bro. Right. You know what and that's what, uh, what was it, Faso? He said that's, he's just like you when you were young. Yeah. He yeah. should have foresaw that. Exactly. You know. You know this kid. Yeah, bro. So, so you, you know how bad you want to take the top spot, and you pissed him off, bro. He knows you. He top was, guy. he was trying to be diplomatic. Yes. He yes. sent the bottle. Yeah. He was trying to. He yes. kept giving him chances. Yes. yes. And I, you know, and I get it. But he was like, he's just trying to kiss my ass. Fuck that. This right. guy's not a real one. Bro, he's trying to he's, he, trying to he's trying to rub bro, you know, rub minds with you know, just just give him a little bit of something. Yeah. Just pretend you're giving us some game, bro. Right. But don't 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 burn a bridge. Yeah, that's the Yeah, end bro, yeah, bro. Literally stab yeah, you in the back. That was literally the bridge between him and his new life and he burned it. He had burned it. It's almost Shakespearean like yeah. uh, Caesar getting stabbed. Oh in the yeah, back. that was a beautiful movie, bro. Yeah. Poetic, you know what I'm saying? I loved it. I'm reloading. Okay. Oh, I did it backwards. Okay, I'm reloaded. Like when he's in the, when the pool hall yeah. with his cousin and shit, man. Uh, so yeah, so that, it, it, it also like, um, you never know when it can help you. Like you were just talking about, which maybe you can hey, bring it up again. Being right. diplomatic, I think, will tell you who, 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 who has your back or not. Because, because if people have your back and someone tries to talk shit, they will not only defend you, they'll come and tell you, like, hey, this person said this and I had your back. You know what I'm saying? Like, so you see, you know, way, diplomat. in a way, you're, 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 your your dip, your diplomacy created some loyalty. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. People are like, you know what? Nah, man, I'm gonna get behind this guy. You know what I'm saying? 
But you know, that, that, that's that's how it is. You know what I'm saying? That, that's what right. diplomacy is, being able to to lead people, you know, inspire people to say, you know what, I'll I'll do what this guy says, I'll have his back, you know, I'll defend him, I'll I'll take a bullet for him, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that's you know, that it takes diplomacy, you know, to say, right. you know what, this guy, he deserves my protection, my my sword, my gun, my shield, you know what I'm saying? Right. Boy, this caffeine is going. Yeah, like, damn. <laughs> How many more lists? How many more words are you gonna leave from the thesaurus? I don't know. I was trying to. Be <laughs> um, uh, trying. Nah, I'm just kidding. Keep, it keeps the podcast longer. Yeah. What the 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 bomb? The joke bomb? No, me. Oh no, no, no! I love it. I love it. I love it. I was just trying to say because the K, like you could have kept going. Go ahead, I'm gonna follow it up. I was gonna say, I mean, I guess you can be a good diplomat would be somebody who can, I guess, take a bad situation and still turn it out into a positive way where everybody still wins out. Ooh, because there's a good saying. Sometimes you make the right decision, sometimes you make the decision right. What do you mean? Like, okay. Can you give an example? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, look, sometimes you make the right decision and shit goes your way and we're like, boom, let's go. Sometimes you don't make the right decision. We gotta figure out a way to make it right. So, but for, for once again, and I'll tell you, and, I, and after I say it again, I'll tell you who said it. Sometimes you make the right decision, sometimes you make the decision right. Dr. Phil said that. I, I, I'm convinced that that dude is like, was a military dude. He's from Texas, ain't he? Yeah. Yeah. Because Kid Craddock used to have him on there. They're like friends. I think they killed Kid Craddock yeah. because he would talk about Kim Trail and shit. Sorry. Uh, you know, into the black hole. I believe, but uh, but yeah, I, I believe Dr. Phil was in some military shit. You know that dude. That some of the that dude's quotes are really fucking good. You know, on some on some like on some like like I said on some military guy shit. You know, like what do you mean? Like he was like in the military. He was like he was something. Yeah, counseling for them. No, no, I think this dude was, was legit. ex-military. Yeah, yeah, something. You know, intelligent something. You know, he he knows his shit. He, 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 that character he puts out of a nice country guy, bro, he created that for a reason. To, to, to be to, diplomatic. To, yeah, to, to be able to... Yeah, to drop people's defenses. Like, for example, right. people expect... My, if you know me, you see me, right? You might expect me to approach you a certain way because of how I look or whatever the fuck or the vibe you get from me. But when I approach you, and I approach you in a humble way, in a way where I'm like, hey, you know, it's respectful. You're like, whoa, I didn't expect that. It throws you off, and you, what you do, you just gotta go with it. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, yeah. bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. That's Dr. Phil. Dr. Phil, he did, it's, 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 it's a disarming personality. That, that, that's, <coughs> so, yeah. yeah. But there's different levels of being diplomatic, right? Some people know how to talk their way. Some people just have to, their presence can create a, a like, oh, I, I don't know, I trust this guy. Something about this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? I feel like he was so real that the hand had to uh, put, like, a tarnish yeah, bro, on he, his yeah, name he, with he was bad baby. He was trying to put a spotlight on Charles Traffic in there at the end, bro. Like, oh, he, yeah, yeah, he was, yeah. They, so, they, I think they, they used him yeah. to put out this, the opposite of him. Yeah. Bad baby, where there's, like, this underage girl, and then now she's, like, on OnlyFans. Look at how stupid shit. society is, guy. You know? That's kind of what he's trying to say, in a way. Yeah. This is where our kids are watching. So, there's a theory about Michael Bay that he... he He's like making fun of the people who are watching his movies because he puts like these uh, like racist undertones like on Transformers. He had these two of these, they were like real hood. And like, a, I don't know, it's an interesting theory. And he's oh, yeah, like, he's making fun of us. Yeah, the cars. Yeah, and, right, 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 right. yeah, and it was like just saying people keep buying this shit. So I was like, well, it's also maybe he just knows how easy it is to get people. He knows how yeah. gullible people are. Like, of course they're gonna and eat what, this right up. Yeah, this, this type of stuff is like. It's almost kid like. It, it's like yeah. uh, low level. Like people, like it, be, it became a joke about Michael Bay's dramatic and the amount of unnecessary explosions. But you know what? Right. People still went and go to watch right. that shit, bro. Right. They, 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 they put it out there how stupid it is. Right. You know what I'm saying? They're yes. like, oh, oh, I still want to go see it, man. It looks pretty interesting, man. You know what I'm saying? I like that boom. You know what I'm saying? That song, that song sounds like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know did, what you, mean? did you see Chippendale? Mm hmm. Well, there's a one part where they have they make fun of uh, Fast and Furious, and they're like it's like Fast and Furious babies, and there's like Mr. Doubtfire. It was making fun of all the reboots. Or... Who's uh, who's that? Chip and Dale, the the little squirrel, the chipmunks, Chip and Dale Rescue the Rangers, the and chipmunks. This is a, this is a movie that came it's out. A or Disney what? Show, it's on Disney. It's on Disney Plus. It's, it's a, a show. Movie. It's a movie. And they make fun of stuff. It's, what? It's really I kind of want to see that. Ugly Sonic. Is yeah. you, you're making me think. Okay, okay. I like it, bro. I'm, I think I'm, I'm, I'm going to transport you back. I want you to Animaniacs. 
there's a, there's a little part where there's two pigeons that talk to each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah the mafia ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah they yeah. talk it's shit. Three, I think. Yeah, they yeah. talk shit to each. Is that, this is what I'm picturing? Is that what's going on? No, there's only two of them. They're brothers. Well, there's only two, but that scene, it's just. I'm gonna have to watch a preview. Of it. That's fucking. We're, we're totally wasting time right here. People are like, what the fuck? Nah, but I, maybe they'll watch it. People are like, they're like, dude, this you don't you haven't seen it, you old motherfucker. I'm sorry. You know what I'm right. Anyway, All right, so being diplomatic, being I think... Being diplomatic means I, I, I respect that I'm, I'm, I'm interrupting the podcast. Also, I think you have, like, a, when you're around kids, I think a true diplomat changes their... They're not going to talk the way they talk with their boys. They know there's a time and a place yeah. for mm-hmm. certain situations. They, 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 you get a certain respect, just... I don't know, they feel it. Something. Something in them. You know, they know they're like, okay, I gotta yeah, they, yeah, change my yeah. level. They get they get in your presence. Myself. Yeah, they get in your presence and they, they you can feel it. They're like, oh some authorities right here, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, I feel you. I feel you. But yeah, but you also you can't talk to them the way you talk to your friends. Mm-hmm. No, of course not. Right? Because they You shouldn't. You right. shouldn't because then you're not then they'll get a different they'll get a whole different image of you now. Right. If you want to keep that respect. You have to. You have to. You have to conduct yourself. Yeah, how, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's true. Like, like, yeah, like, like for example, how how they perceive it is not how necessarily how you think they're gonna perceive it. Exactly. That's why. Yeah. That's why. Yeah. You you being diplomatic is knowing how to switch tones, levels of voice with different people. Like, I'm gonna be right here talking to your little four year old niece and nephew. I'm gonna turn around over here talk to your mom. I'm gonna turn around here talk to you. I'm gonna turn around here talk to my mom. And, and then like a like a grandma. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I have, different types I have, of. Yeah, I have to be able to switch up all my and that's how it is. You know, if you want to think about diplomat, imagine back in the day, uh, let's say in, in beautiful you know Tsar Tsar Russia. You know what I'm saying? Or where a diplomat had to walk into one of those balls and make make eye contact and shake hands and have some kind of small talk with about 30 different individuals in different countries before he made it to the side of the room. Right. He had to be diplomatic as fuck to not insult anybody, not give the wrong impression. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I think is fucking up diplomacy? Social media. Oh, okay, I thought you There's I, no filter. I thought people you were saying name, yeah. People, people think that yeah, they have the right, have the they right to have, say shit. Yeah, they're just, there's no filter. And they forget that, you know, being hurtful Sucks, bro. Yeah, a lot of people online though are just sad people anyway. Those people, yeah. those comments you see people talking shit, they're just like, they're just making up for their lack of like, I don't do anything in my life but sit on here social uh, media and criticize. Well, Elon Musk actually exposed that a lot of the fucking uh, Twitter accounts were spam accounts and bots. Right. Yeah, so, man, look at that, that's crazy. A lot man. of the negative who, who, comments who, 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 and stuff that being said is like, who, AI, who, I think, or like, who would have thought? Us conspiracy theorists? Yeah. Who people used to call crazy? But he he's he's iffy to me too because he wants to do the Neuralink. Yeah, you, you're stuck on that. Yeah, that brain shit, bro. We'll we'll we'll, we'll get we'll, 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 we'll yeah, get back on that. Yeah, that's We'll get back on that. But he's very. You think he's diplomatic? He's kind of wild, right? He makes like as a billionaire, like yeah, he no, makes he's jokes not, about not. Bill Gates. He, he, like, he clearly has a, He clearly has scripts he's reading mm. to get to get the like the the news, you know, like the headlines. You know what I'm saying? I just watched this. It's from 1993, a C-SPAN doc, one hour little documentary about this guy who wrote a book about how uh, the government and and the media and all these people who are real rich, like, uh, they want to be like royal to like kings. So like Reagan, Nancy Reagan, whenever she used to go to hotels, they had to paint the room red and then they had to lower all the mirrors and if not, she'd be fucking pissed. And so that cost money. And so, like, a lot of these people who are in power, whether it's businesses or not, they start... Oh, like, somebody said, somebody took business class instead of first class and told Congress, if we all went to business instead of first, we could save $12 million. So one of the... Some, some senator was like, this is disgusting to even suggest this. You don't care about our comfort. You know, fuck you. And it's just like, yeah. wow. They'll, they'll be like, what are you, communists or something? Yeah. Right. Like, th- these people do not want to give up their comfort. You know? Yeah, that's. They don't. Get, they don't give a fuck about themselves. Yeah. How do we get this podcast? That's not. That's not how diplomatic. Do, how do we get to this right now? I don't know, but that's not diplomatic. I'm like, yeah, right now I'm not sounding very diplomatic, sir. They're not diplomatic. Oh. Even though oh. they're supposed, they're the ones right. that are supposed. Oh, they just to they be. just want their way. Oh, oh I see what you're trying themselves. to. Oh, 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 oh yeah. nah, this is totally with the podcast. They'll use yeah. the people to get themselves into that level of power, and then they just they just look out for themselves, they look out for their buddies, and they're looking out for the world. That right. sounds communist. Yeah. For real. If we looked at it everywhere, what happened? Okay, Cuba, what happened? A couple of dudes promised to take over the, to overturn the government and, and for the people, what happened? One dude took over everything. Uh, what happened in China? Oh, we're, everything is for the people. It's the people's republic. What happens? One dude killed like 50 million people. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
This is not, yeah, this is not a vow. You gotta be so. careful with that. You can get demonetized for saying that. Well, we haven't, we gotta get monetized first. Yeah, let's do it. This might we gotta get to a thousand person. Yeah. Um, but, uh. That's what happened in uh, Russia. Yeah, Russia. What happened? These dudes came together as a group. Bolsheviks came yeah. and then for the people. got beat by Lenin. We're the people's army. You know what I'm saying? We're for the people. We're militia there. You know what I'm saying? Then Lenin died and then Stalin took over. So that's what he, the guy he came out in '93. So the guy in the doc, in the interview about the book, that's when Clinton came out, and so Clinton would say stuff like that too. But he was like, they were taken away. It's just they have this. Oh, he said everybody's they're like puppets, and they read a script. He said Reagan was like definitely just reading. The script. He didn't know anything about anything. Oh, okay, see now, now I think now I have I have I have to. I have oh, because maybe that's false. Uh, yes. Yeah. But I, he was an actor though, right? He was. Okay. He was an actor. But this dude. But does the claim that yes. he was like didn't know anything about anything? Yes, it's no. the same way they talk about forty five. Because because Reagan was a real one. I got. I, 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 I mean, he's he's the reason I'm yes. in America. I'm telling you, but he's I, the reason my dad is here. I, so I, I can't talk I'm to him. Like I don't yeah. know. He's on the level of forty five. Real shit. This I'm is sure. why this is why they make everything he did so look so bad. They try to make it look like he fucked everything up. Like he was a loser. Of course they would. Nixon was the loser. Uh, not so much. He, he just fucked. He, he was he was more the patsy. He was, he, right? Yes, yes, he was too easy to set up. His personality, the way he was so uptight, he was so easy for the DS to set up. You know so maybe saying? not, maybe not right. Maybe after them, they became like puppets, like yeah, for sure Clinton and them. They became like celebrities. They may use celebrities. He was talking about to like to keep people distracted. Yeah, yeah. like uh, and it's all it's that's, all that's a script. What, that's what the whole Marilyn Monroe mixing her in the White House thing was about was to create right, distractions. Right. You know what I'm saying? Create distractions. So we don't. So people don't worry about like or think about yeah. real shit. So, they're so, worried about these celebrities so, and they're sending letters to yes. celebrities, giving so, them their. It's also heart. it's also a good way to think about why why 45 had that wife. People would talk all this stuff about her and kind of like not pay. You know, not he he was just taped behind the scenes doing his thing either way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. She was she was like a shield for him. You know what I'm saying? Mm. That's a good woman same yeah anyhow yeah, being diplomatic means that you know you have to use the proper terms to not get in trouble you know what i'm saying but also like to be the able she, to them, stuff like, like that? no no like what i just did oh the numbers yes yeah, 45 you know what i'm saying to also be able to go into like what 45 did for the emirate states and mm -hmm. in, in yeah, bro, peace in the Middle East. Anybody remember? No, because now we got war over there. Man. And we're giving way too much of a fuck about it. My bad. Yeah. Not sorry, sorry. Yeah, it, 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 it's, cra it's crazy. But that, that yeah. whole situation in the Middle East is the end of itself a, a shit show. Now. From the beginning. From oh, yeah, years, I forgot, I forgot years, about Afghanistan. Years. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. I can't forget about Good it. Good gravy, yeah. Well, I just meant like the Middle East. Since Bible time, it's always been like, oh, yeah, fucking crazy. Well, that's well what, I that's... mean, it really got worse after uh, the World War One when they when the Ottomans lost and they had to split all that land up. Oh, we were talking those. about the, I was talking to them about the Ottomans earlier, you know, because like? they were the Muslims, yes, yes. See, see, I talk, see, of we're talking about like and, the Christianity and the fighting. Whoa, 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 now you're gonna give on the side. And what they did was that they did the same thing to the Middle East that they did to Africa, they just Got this random ass map, never explored it, never got anywhere past the beaches or whatever, so they don't know what the terrain looks like. They didn't know anything about the tribes that lived there, none of right. that. It just went on the map, split it all up, and says, okay, you get a piece, you get a piece, and you get a piece. Right. And this is how, this is the map that's drawn. They didn't, and did you think these tribes knew where these fucking right. lines are drawn? No. Exactly. So you're pushing, you know, Pakistani, let's say Pakistani descendants with. Iraqi descendants all in one area where they're rival fucking tribes. What the fuck do you think is gonna happen? Right. It's gonna be wars. Damn. Orchestrated. It's like they want them to kill each other so we don't have it's, to do it. Maybe. In a sense, where I would say it's like the puppet master took all these puppets and let them be stupid, but in reality, he created all this. He knew what the terrain was, he knew what these people were doing, but he used these little small diplomats and their own stupidity to draw a line on the map, knowing the chaos it was going to create. And, and Africa, yeah, they had no diplomacy to the Africans, because that was, they just, 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 like, France got a piece, like, all these different places got a piece of Africa. Oh, dude, right? you, the Dutch, the French, the, what was it, Portuguese? It was, like, popular... They were like celebrities. Not Great Britain. And if you didn't own anything outside of your own country, then you weren't cool, basically, I feel like. No, it was just a cash grab of, of 
taking what the natives had and making that's it for true. themselves. The problem. Right. That's not diplomatic. No, I know, I know it's not diplomatic. I'm just saying that they were like, yeah, yeah, yeah. they were like, like it was to be cool, but I guess it is to be to make money. Like, like in the in the different islands and shit, you get all the Slave sugar people. cane. And yeah, the people. Being diplomatic, also, uh, fuck, I lost it. Keep talking for a second. But that, like, you could have made peace with these tribes or whatever, and figured out, okay, where are the terrain lie. But instead, they said, nah, this is our land. We 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 established here. It would have been diplomatic for them to go meet it. them, and yeah, it'd have been a better thing. Said they fought and took it, you know, and then enslaved the people to do. People, they, they don't, want. they don't want us to be diplomatic with each other. Like people are so hard headed now with their own. They're like of social you, media help you that. Like yeah, you but like if you, yeah, if, if you. But even before. Oh, oh, I know what I was gonna say. Go Being diplomatic helps you put stupid ideas across that make them sound good. Like real talk. So mm-hmm. many, so much of the stuff that Kissinger, I. Kissinger. I was gonna learn about Kissinger earlier. Oh. They said he's like he knows how to. Well, in that book, that guy, the same guy, he said that Kissinger knew how to. Say stuff in the right way. He's manipulative as fuck. Well. Yes, that's what he said about He's manipulative as fuck. Well. Yeah. Look at that. Dude. He could come up with any theory for any agenda. Oh, yeah. That I don't know who it was uh, Nixon or somebody. Yes. Or like yes. Yeah. He 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 has a toilet for right now. Just shit comes out of it. Right. You know what I'm saying? Um. Anyhow, uh, like for example, a lot of the theories that I've had. I mean, if you want to know what they are, just listen to the stuff that we podcast about. I've had to put those ideas across to 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 to, to old, you know, old school people. Ooh, you gotta be diplomatic about yes, it. Yes, you know what I'm saying. You have to, yes, yes, you know what I'm saying. Like, uh, I, you know, I, and that's that that takes that takes a lot. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. In order to take all the because they're gonna criticize you at first. Yeah, they have a lot of patience. You have to be able to take the yeah, patience, discipline. You know what I'm saying. Know know what points to hit. Know what not to. You know what I'm saying. Right. Like, there's some people that get triggered by certain things. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. So it's, 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 Being diplo- diplomatic, you, you gotta try not to get you. Triggered. You have to learn how to approach her, all kinds of people, you know, because yeah. you know this has got to be, and and you will gain more experience and more and more diplomacy points when you're able to do that. You know, more I know it's scary. It's scary at first. I get it. There's some personalities that are just hard to approach. I get it. Right. But at the end of the day, if you can learn how to do it, then then you know what? Nothing will live intimidate. No, people won't intimidate you, bro. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. You just learn. Hey, what are you doing? Take somebody back. Fuck them. Oh, look at that, 22-22. Right, it's good enough. Yeah. yeah so, you got saying. something to say about diplomacy? Mm-hmm. Diplomat? Nah, because then I'll just start going on a tangent of who we think that is, who we think is the most undiplomatic country. Oh, I don't know. Nah, yeah, that, 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 yeah, then, then, then people will say you're being racist. No, because I was going to say the British Empire. That's racist, you're not white. That's said racist. They enslaved everybody in the world. Still, you're not. They used to have a saying where the the sun never sets on the on the British Empire. Right now, yeah, the Vatican though. Did the Vatican always control England? The, the Rome, no. Rome, no. Rome, Rome, Rome. Well, Rome originally established there. Well, right. I guess when the Gallic tribes were there too, but yeah, but they weren't really um, doing shit. What is it? Uh, but they abandoned it, so London became itself. They warred with France. It did a lot. I mean, they. they once they were able to create these big ass ships and start sailing everywhere and establishing everywhere, they had a piece of every piece of land everywhere. Mm-hmm. In India, in Australia, in freaking Africa, the Middle East. The States, North America. The States, Canada, Mexico. Probably South America too. South America as well. Shit, they probably got they probably got a key to the wall. Australia is the British colony. Oh yeah, Australia. Good shit, son. But you Canada, know the prison. Canada is the British colony, uh, right? You got that right. You know, everybody wants to sit there. And remember who was the innovator of the slave trade was Great Britain. Everybody wants to try to th- whoa, whoa. throw America under the bus with that. It's like, no, nah, the British Empire were, were way worse with it. Right. All right. I've read a lot of the stories of, of, of their their little endeavors in the slave trade. It was bad. Right. We got it from our parents. The United States got it from their parents, from Britain. In a sense. Yes. Right. Right. And we had to, like, break that generational curse mm. all right but that's why i think they're the worst <laughs> diplomatic country in, in, in the entire world <laughs> like, all right <laughs> all right that's good man all right love yeah. y'all peace, peace.